For the fifth consecutive year in 2023, Airbus has once again eclipsed Boeing in aircraft deliveries and secured more orders, further cementing its dominance in the skies. With the A321, a formidable Titan stretching 45 meters long, leading their sales, and the A380, only the world's largest passenger airliner, requiring unparalleled manufacturing might, one can't help but wonder just how vast must the factories be to construct these behemoths of the air. The world's largest Airbus factory is the Airbus A380 assembly facility, part of the Jean-Luc Lagardère plant located in Toulouse, France. This factory is specifically designed for the assembly of the Airbus A380, which is the world's largest passenger airliner. The facility is a testament to Airbus's engineering prowess and its commitment to innovation in the aerospace industry. The Jean-Luc Lagardère plant nestled in the outskirts of Toulouse serves as a pivotal element within the expansive Airbus manufacturing complex. This location does not just capitalize on its proximity to other Airbus operational hubs, it is a testament to strategic planning, allowing seamless integration with facilities dedicated to the final assembly of various aircraft models, alongside cutting-edge research and development centers. This synergy enhances operational efficiency and innovation in aerospace engineering. Spanning an area impressive by any standard, the Jean-Luc Lacadère plant covers 122,500 square meters, approximately 1,320,000 square feet, and boasts a volume of 5.6 million cubic meters, approximately 199 million cubic feet. Uniquely designed to handle the assembly of the Airbus A380, the world's largest passenger airliner. The A380's assembly process is a marvel of logistics and engineering, necessitating the coordination of massive components such as wings, which span over 79 meters, fuselage sections, and the tail fin, standing taller than an eight-story building. These components originate from different corners of Europe, including the UK, Spain, France, and Germany, showcasing Airbus's transnational manufacturing approach. Transporting these gargantuan parts to the Jean-Luc Lagardère plant involves a logistical ballet, combining road, sea, and air. Notably, the Airbus Beluga transport aircraft plays a critical role in this process. The Beluga, with its distinctive bulbous shape designed to accommodate oversized cargo, is a sight to behold as it ferries aircraft parts across European skies. This logistical operation is so precise and well-coordinated that it's often likened to a carefully choreographed dance, ensuring that parts arrive just in time for assembly, minimizing storage needs and expediting the production process. A fun fact about the facility and the Airbus A380 assembly process is the use of the Beluga transport aircraft, named after the Beluga whale due to its similarly large and bulbous forehead. This unique aircraft is crucial for transporting the A380's large parts, symbolizing Airbus's innovation in overcoming logistical challenges. The plant and its operations highlight the interconnectedness of European aerospace manufacturing and the innovative solutions developed to bring such an enormous aircraft to life. Moreover, the strategic decision to locate the Jean-Luc Lagardère plant within the Airbus complex in Toulouse is no coincidence. Toulouse is often referred to as La Ville Rose, the Pink City, due to the terracotta bricks used in many of its buildings, but it could easily be dubbed the City of Aerospace, given its role as a global hub for aerospace research, development, and manufacturing. The city's history is deeply intertwined with aviation, hosting a multitude of aerospace companies, research institutions, and being the birthplace of Concorde, another iconic aircraft. The assembly of an Airbus A380 at the Jean-Luc Lagardère plant is a testament to the pinnacle of modern manufacturing techniques and international collaboration. This process is not just about assembling the world's largest passenger aircraft, it's a choreographed sequence of engineering precision, teamwork, and technological innovation. Each stage of the assembly is a critical piece of a larger puzzle, requiring meticulous attention to detail and coordination across continents. The A380's wings are crafted in the facilities of Broughton, Wales, and Filton, England. These wings are not only remarkable for their size, but also for their advanced aerodynamics and the complex systems they house, including fuel systems, landing gear, and flight controls. 
The production of these wings employs state-of-the-art composite materials to reduce weight while maintaining strength and flexibility, critical for the aircraft's fuel efficiency and performance. The fuselage sections, the main body of the aircraft, are produced in Germany and Spain. These cylindrical sections are made with precision to ensure a seamless fit during assembly. The fuselage not only accommodates passengers but also houses the cargo hold, wiring, and plumbing for the aircraft systems. Sections are designed with advanced aluminum alloys and composite materials, contributing to the aircraft's overall structural integrity and efficiency. The tail fin, an essential component for the aircraft's stability and control, along with other critical components, are sourced from various locations across Europe, showcasing Airbus's extensive supply chain and the collaborative nature of the A380 project. The integration of components from different countries underlines the A380's status as a symbol of European industrial cooperation and technical prowess. Upon their arrival at the Toulouse facility, these giant aircraft components are transported into the assembly hall, a vast space designed specifically to accommodate the A380's dimensions. Here, cranes of immense capacity lift and position the components into place, a process that demands precision and coordination. The assembly involves thousands of workers, each skilled in different aspects of aircraft construction from riveting and welding to the intricate wiring of electrical systems and the installation of hydraulic systems. The fitting of the interior follows the structural assembly, where the aircraft begins to take on its final form. This phase includes the installation of seating, overhead bins, galleys, lavatories, and the intricate in-flight entertainment systems. Each element of the interior is designed with passenger comfort and safety in mind reflecting the A380's role as a flagship of modern air travel. The entire assembly process of the Airbus A380 is a marvel of logistics, engineering, and human collaboration. It highlights the incredible advancements in aerospace manufacturing, where precision engineering meets cutting-edge technology. An A380 contains over 500 kilometers of wiring and more than 40,000 rivets, each playing a critical role in the aircraft's functionality and safety. Generally, the construction of an Airbus A380 involves thousands of workers and can take about 18 to 24 months from the start of assembly to delivery. The facility responsible for assembling the Airbus A380 is a testament to the pinnacle of aerospace manufacturing, embodying innovation, precision, and scale in every aspect of its operations. This complex is equipped with an array of state-of-the-art technologies and machinery, specifically tailored to meet the colossal demands of constructing the world's largest passenger aircraft. Here, the confluence of engineering marvels and cutting-edge technology creates an environment where the boundaries of aviation are continuously pushed forward. The assembly of an Airbus A380 requires moving and aligning gigantic aircraft components with unparalleled precision. To achieve this, the facility is equipped with high-capacity cranes and sophisticated transport systems. These cranes are engineered to lift and maneuver heavy loads, such as the A380's wings and fuselage sections, with astonishing accuracy. The transport systems, on the other hand, facilitate the seamless movement of these components through the assembly hall. This includes specialized flatbeds and automated guided vehicles AGVs, capable of handling the weight and dimension of A380 parts, ensuring they are delivered to the precise location needed for assembly. In the realm of precision tasks, such as drilling, riveting, and painting, the facility employs advanced robotics and automation technologies. These robotic systems are designed to execute complex and repetitive tasks with a degree of accuracy that far surpasses human capabilities. For instance, the use of automated drilling robots ensures that thousands of holes drilled into the aircraft's skin are perfectly placed and consistent, critical for the structural integrity of the aircraft. Similarly, automated riveting machines apply uniform pressure and precision across countless rivets, a fundamental aspect of aircraft assembly. Given the A380's massive wingspan and its double-deck structure, a standard painting hanger simply won't suffice. The facility boasts a dedicated painting hanger that is large enough to accommodate the A380's dimensions, allowing technicians to apply paint and coatings efficiently. This hangar is not just about size, it's equipped with advanced ventilation systems to control temperature and humidity, ensuring that the paint is applied under optimal conditions for durability and aesthetics. 
The painting process itself involves several layers, including primer, base coat, and protective coatings, each meticulously applied to withstand the rigors of air travel. After painting, every Airbus A380 undergoes rigorous testing and quality control checks before it can take to the skies. The facility houses custom-designed testing and quality control stations equipped with the latest diagnostic tools and technologies. These stations conduct a battery of tests on every system within the aircraft, from hydraulics and electronics to engines and avionics. Vibration tests, stress tests, and system functionality checks are carried out to ensure that each aircraft adheres to Airbus's stringent standards of safety and performance. The quality control process also includes detailed inspections by skilled technicians who scrutinize every aspect of the aircraft for defects or imperfections, ensuring that only the highest quality aircraft are delivered. One of the most fascinating aspects of the A380's assembly process is the precision with which these technologies and systems must operate. For example, the alignment of the fuselage sections requires such accuracy that the tolerances are often compared to the thickness of a human hair. This level of precision ensures the structural integrity and aerodynamic efficiency of the aircraft. The second largest Airbus factory is located in Hamburg, Germany. This facility is crucial for Airbus's operations, focusing on the final assembly of the Airbus A320 family aircraft, which are some of the most popular and best-selling single-aisle aircraft globally. Additionally, the Hamburg site is involved in the assembly of the A380's sections, although the final assembly of the A380 itself takes place in Toulouse, France, and plays a significant role in cabin fitting and paintwork for various Airbus models. Hamburg is also key for Airbus's research and development activities and is home to the Airbus A350 XWB's fuselage and cabin assembly. The Airbus factory in Hamburg stands as a significant pillar in the Airbus production network, complementing the operations of other Airbus sites, such as the one in Toulouse. The Hamburg factory's specialization in the final assembly of the A320 family aircraft, along with its contributions to the A380, A350 XWB, and other models, showcases the diversity and complexity of Airbus's manufacturing and development efforts. The Airbus factory in Hamburg not only exemplifies the height of aviation manufacturing excellence, but also narrates a tale of strategic growth and technological innovation within the European aerospace sector. Situated in the heart of Germany's renowned engineering landscape, the Hamburg site has evolved into a bustling hub for aircraft assembly, research, and development, fostering a symbiotic relationship with the city's rich maritime and industrial heritage. The significance of the Hamburg facility is deeply rooted in the history of Airbus itself, a consortium originally formed to challenge the dominance of American aerospace manufacturers. Since its inception, Airbus has placed a premium on dispersing its production and assembly operations across various European countries, leveraging the unique strengths and expertise of each region. The Hamburg factory emerged as a central piece in this strategy, specializing in the intricate processes of assembling and fitting the interiors of aircraft, a testament to Germany's esteemed precision engineering and craftsmanship. The factory's focus on the A320 family aircraft, renowned for their fuel efficiency, reliability, and comfort, underscores Airbus's commitment to meeting the global demand for single-aisle jets, pivotal for short to medium-haul flights, the site's involvement in the A380 program, despite the aircraft's eventual discontinuation, highlights Hamburg's adaptability and its critical role in managing complex logistical and manufacturing challenges. Furthermore, the Hamburg facility's contribution to the Airbus A350 XWB, a model celebrated for its innovative use of composite materials and advanced aerodynamics, illustrates the site's integral role in pushing the boundaries of aircraft design and sustainability. Beyond manufacturing, the Airbus campus in Hamburg is a beacon for research and development, driving advancements in aviation technology and sustainability. The site's dedication to innovation is evident in its state-of-the-art facilities, where engineers and technicians work tirelessly to enhance aircraft performance, reduce environmental impact, and redefine passenger comfort. In summary, all Airbus factories are pivotal in the company's global production network playing crucial roles in manufacturing, assembly, and delivery of aircraft components and finished airplanes. By doing so, Airbus ensures it remains at the forefront of the aerospace industry, meeting the demands of the present while preparing for the challenges of the future.